Chinese President Xi Jinping will also address the United Nations General Assembly on Tuesday, like Sidhan just mentioned. And Chinese foreign ministry has confirmed that Xi Jinping will deliver a virtual video message at the annual event. Now, the 76th United Nations General Assembly opened on the 14th of September. However, the general debate of the session will begin on Tuesday and will continue till the 27th of September. Even as the world recovers from the COVID-19 pandemic that first emerged in Wuhan, China, more than 100 heads of states and government, as well as foreign ministers and diplomats, will participate in this uh, general uh, debate in person. However, Chinese Foreign Ministry has confirmed that President Xi Jinping will attend the summit virtually. The ministry says that President Xi will deliver an important speech. However, it failed to elaborate on which areas he will focus on. President Xi's, uh, Xi's address uh, to the UNGA comes days after the US, UK and Australia announced a new security alliance called the AUKUS, which is widely seen as an effort to counter Chinese influence and disputed territorial claims in the South China Sea. Under the AUKUS deal, Australia will get technology to build nuclear-powered submarines. While Australia rubbish the concerns raised by Beijing is embarrassing, President Xi Jinping may use this platform to highlight the security challenges facing China due to the emergence of this new bloc. President Xi is also expected to touch upon the evolving situation in Afghanistan. China has been holding discussions with Taliban officials and regional powers on the Afghan security situation. China has been actively highlighting its stand on the Afghan crisis ever since Taliban seized power in Kabul last month. On 17th of September, in his address to the 21st session of the Shanghai Cooperation Organization, Xi Jinping called on the member nations to facilitate smooth transfer of power in Afghanistan. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.